Uh, thank you for asking me about Steve. You know, the, the neat part about him is that he has such a passion for the equines, and he's had it for a long time. He started at an early age working with horses, has great skills with them, played polo, was a polo coach, and still is, and works hard. His free time is spent with the equines. And I think a passion is so important in a person that's making a living in this profession to have that passion, to have the skills with the horses. After that, he's great with people. He's a good communicator. He gets his point across and has always been really interested in learning more, always learning more. He got his bachelor's at Cornell, and all the time he was there, he spent time with Harold Mowers, who was the, the great instructor at Cornell at that time. And Harold kind of took him under his wing, helped him out, Steve always had questions, spent a lot of time with him. And when Harold retired, Buster was there. And, and Steve was always interested in new products and new techniques and new technology. And he opened up a supply shop, which was great for all the farriers in this part of the country, that there was a place they could go. And, and Steve was really good at getting new technology, new products, better products in to help out with the farriers in this area. But he didn't only help by supplying supplies. He also helped that he was very interested in having a, a regional group of farriers that would communicate together and get together. It was getting the farriers together so they communicated. And that spurred a whole new communication venue in this part of the world that farriers were able to talk. But not only in communicating about the owners and the horses, but about education or products. The interesting part was there was such a dynamic change in the communication with farriers. When I started my career, there was very little communication. It was very helpful in this part of the world in changing all of that, and also between the veterinarians. So I'm really impressed with what he's done in his career, and not only there at Cornell, but also through Mustad. I'm proud of what Steve has done, and I'm proud to know him.